using the color code chart to customize colors on your website. So make sure that you have the color code chart link open, as I do, and also your website link open. And uh, one of the nice things is I can change how my content, my headers, and the stuff I put on my page look by choosing different themes. There's simple, there's Aristotle, the diplomat. And um, let's say you chose a theme, but you're not really happy with your color choices. And in this case, I have this little logo up here, and it's a uh, little green frog in an umbrella. And I want my colors to pick up on this color of the little green frog. So I don't have it as a choice here. However, if you go to the very last one, you can actually customize it if you know the code of the color you want by putting that code right here. So when I look at my color code chart, um, I think maybe the shade of green that I want is, I'm gonna try this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and copy the color, Control C, and go to my Google site, to that last color, customizing it. Remember, you click here to get to where you can change things, and I'm going to go Control V, and notice how it has changed. And I think that's what I will keep for now. The nice thing is that it allows you to go ahead and, if you choose this emphasis portion, uh, make things look a little um, more interesting, and it kind of ties in with one of the colors on my logos. Go ahead and try this on your website now.